start point, Kanmaja Ferry Port. The start will take place on the dummy barge set up on the Kanmaja Ferry Port in line with the order you see on your screen. In order swimmers to take the starting positions, the athletes boats will dock between the Kanmaja Port and the barge. There will be special garbage boxes at your areas and at both gates where you can throw away your masks, slippers, etc. before the start. With the opening of the ferry exit doors, first the age groups and then the physically handicapped and special athletes group will walk over the magnetic carpets on the barge and jump into the water to start the race. As the magnetic carpets located right in front of the strip barrier will interact with the ankle chips to set the individual start time of the swimmers, the competitors should never step on the magnetic carpets before the start. The start of the race will be given at 10 a.m. with the starting horn. Following the sound of the horn, the strip barrier will be opened and the swimmers will pass over the magnetic carpet to jump into the water. An early jump will not give the swimmers any advantage because their individual time will start at the moment the ankle chip interacts with the magnetic carpet. Each swimmer's time will be determined separately. For this reason, we kindly request you not to rush to jump into the water and obstruct each other. Any such unsportsmanlike behaviour will lead to disqualification in line with the evaluation of the starting referees. Race course. The race will take place between Kamnaja to Kurucheshme at a water temperature of 20 to 24 degrees on a 6.5 km track under the direction of Commodore. Less saline waters from the Black Sea create a surface current towards the Sea of Marmara. The speed of this current varies from season to season, according to weather and wind conditions and the geographical structure of the Bosphorus shores. This current, which generally supports swimmers, changes direction in some regions and comes from the opposite direction. Anadolu Hisaru Kuchuksu Bebek and Arnavut Co coves are the areas where the reverse currents are seen. It is suggested that the contestants watch out for these variable current conditions, swim by using the midline of the Bosphorus. After jumping into the water, the swimmers should target the pillar of the Fatih Sultan Mehmet bridge at the European side and swim in that direction. When the swimmer feels that the water temperature drops a few degrees, it means that he has caught the channel current that will accompany him until the end of the race. After this point, the next target should be the middle of the bridge. When the swimmer reaches below the bridge, his next target should be in the middle point of the high voltage transmission line between Kandili and Bebek. That is, the closest point of the line to the water. When the swimmer reaches this point, the next target should be the midpoint of the 50 July Martyrs Bridge. This route will take swimmers about 150 meters off Galatasaray Island. Once aligned with Galatasaray Island, swimmers will have entered the last 300 to 400 meters of the race. From this point on, Kuruceshme Jemil Toposla Park finish point should be the target and they should swim in this direction. Finish point, Kuruceshme. The finish point at the Jemil Topuzla Park is marked with coloured large air balloons and the flashing signals on the control tower. The contestants will make use of these marks in identifying their directions towards the finish. The finish point consists of surface water barges with ladders and covered with a detection mat. The swimmers will climb up any of the ladders to set foot on the barge and their course completion times will be determined by the ankle chips that will interact with the detection mat. The swimmers who have not stepped on the magnetic carpets will be deemed DNF, did not finish, and will not receive certificates or awards. For your safety. Throughout the race, swimmers should make effort to swim continuously so as not to lose time and get cold, and not take hold their head out of the water very often. Swimmers should check their routes as well as the escort boat while swimming. 
You can stop the coldness felt during the race by adjusting your swimming tempo and terminate the cramps might be felt with gentle and light tempo movements. Surface security, the most important element of the race, will be provided by the inflatable boats and canoes. These boats and canoes, which will escort the swimmers along the course, will have all kinds of equipment and personnel to intervene against any kind of negativities the swimmers may experience. In the event that a swimmer feels difficulty in breathing, fatigue, unpreventable cold and shivering and unbearable cramp aches, Without losing time, he, she should ask for help by raising their hands or removing their swimming caps from their heads and waving them. They should wait without panic until the nearest safety unit reaches them. It should not be forgotten that the actions made in panic may put both the swimmer, him, herself and the swimmers around at risk. The race can be completed within 60 minutes on average with correct streaming and a comfortable swimming pace. The race will officially expire two hours after the last swimmer has jumped into the water. With the instruction and approval of the Commodore, the swimmers who cannot complete the race within that 120 minutes time frame will be collected from the water wherever they are located and will be brought to Jemil Topuz Le Park on inflatable boats. Athletes who do not obey the warning to get out of the water will be disqualified from the race. We wish success to all competitors at the cross-continental swimming race.